everyone. So today we're going to take you on a little tour around this magical village they call Fornaluch. Now, as you can probably tell by what I'm wearing, it's a little bit chilly today, at least for Mallorca standards. It's about 15, 16 degrees. But we thought, why not take you guys on a little tour around the village in the quieter months, in the winter time. It's actually the time of year that I thrive in Mallorca. I love the winter. After a long summer, there is nothing better than when you feel like you get the island back to yourself and the temperatures drop and it's just beautiful, as you can see. Now, I have to admit, I have a slight soft spot for, for Naluch. I sold my very first house in 2014, I think it was, in this very street. It was a really cute three bedroom townhouse. I actually sold my very first three houses in Fornaluch. I'm sure the owners of the business were thinking there are other places to sell houses, you know, Maria. But I don't know, maybe people just picked up on the love that I have for Fornaluch. I don't know, but that's how it happened. But anyway, that's where it started. That's where my whole real estate journey started. Um, and I couldn't have asked for a more idyllic place to start. If somebody were to ask you to close your eyes and draw up the most picturesque, idyllic Mediterranean mountain village that you could possibly imagine, then I'm pretty sure Fornaluch is exactly what would come to mind. I feel like Fornaluch perfectly encapsulates that essence of slow living, which I know a lot of us are in search of today. It's always been a place for attracting artists that are in search of inspiration. But today we've seen a real surge in families looking to relocate here now that you can work from pretty much wherever you want in the world. And a lot of families are choosing Fornaluch to, to bring their families. There's a fantastic school. And for a village that really feels like it doesn't have a lot, it, actually has everything you could possibly need. There's a fantastic local school and you've also got an array of international schools, fantastic international schools, just about a scenic 25 minute drive through the mountains. You can spend your weekends hiking and cycling the many routes that depart from the village. You've got the famous GR221 which I'm sure many of you already know. And there's also one of my favorites, which is the Barrang de Binyarech, which departs from the village that's located between Soya and Fornaluch. Beautiful village, might I add. And just like that, we've brought you high up above Fornaluch. We thought this would be the perfect spot to give you that outlook on to Fornaluch to give you a real sense of the size of the village. I hope you appreciate the view behind me, it's pretty special. So Fornaluch sits about three kilometers north of Soyer and as I said before it makes it a really nice bike ride between the two villages. Um, that's what I really love about Fornaluch is you get that real sense of being almost retreated and secluded in the mountains but at the same time you can dip in and out of uh, Soyer and Palma and also you've got the sea which is about seven kilometers from Fornaluch about seven minute drive so you really get to dip in and out of that kind of all year round buzz you've got the soya market on a saturday but then you can kind of sit back and retreat in the mountains in your kind of almost private oasis as i said before you've got so little here but at the same time you've got everything you need you've got as i mentioned before a local school uh, you've got pharmacy you've got a medical center you've got two absolutely incredible uh, bakeries you've got some fantastic restaurants you've got access to the sea you've got access to soya so it really is an all-round kind of village even though it feels so small and quaint and quiet and that's what i absolutely love about it I hope you enjoyed our walk around the village and 
I always feel like we have so much more to say, but it's really hard to kind of condense it into this video. So if you'd like to hear more about, I don't know, holidaying, living, buying in Fornaluch, or maybe you're just looking to visit and you want to know the best time to come, then please reach out. We'd really love to help you. And until then, let's just say bye for now. Bye.